Hey, what's up, what's up? Assalamu alaikum, everybody. Welcome to 70 Things I Learned, a blog and videos where I share my experiences and reflections. Motivational books, chapter 1, the Quran, part 2. Last time we talked about how inspiring the Quran has been in my life. It taught me purpose, but most importantly, self discipline and empathy. In this bonus episode, I would like to share some few words that I wrote about the Quran. Isn't it time to show appreciation to the spoken word of God to His creation? The Qur'an, that book of salvation to humanity, is simplicity and purification. It is a book of guidance first and foremost, but it's also a miracle, peace and clarification. It is not to hang in our walls and make pretty, but it's to follow, practice and recitation. Each letter you read is not one, D, two or three, but ten, and in Ramadan there is multiplication. It is to be taken as a whole, not in bits and pieces. How useful is a puzzle piece in isolation? Some claim it teaches violence and oppression. How is it that every chapter is in the name of the merciful and starts with compassion? Didn't you read 532 or 2177? Murdering a single soul is like killing humanity, and righteousness is charity and also believing in heaven? It was downloaded by an angel to the illiterate of men. He embodied and became the most beloved. How was that possible without holding a pen? Everything it touches, it makes better. In almost every page, it declares God is one. You can try to burn it, discredit it, or put up a gun, but just tell me, how are you planning to cover up the sun? Peace. These are not good for what I've said me since from Allah, and I've been blessed to share it. If it's wrong or false for me and shaitan, I always remember I'm only human. Peace.